Oh, hello YouTube. How are you doing? Well, it is now pretty much a year since we started on this thing. And I figured I'd come over and do an update. I'd come uh, check out a, a coach battery on it. Uh, it. We do believe that the battery is giving up the ghost. Um, I figured I'd also bring you guys along to do an update video. Uh, Joe has used a, uh, a uh, basically a rubberized coating to do the, to paint it. Um, let's do the stripes and he did the cab. Um, it was a Gorilla Grip product. Kind of fun stuff to apply. Basically like a bed liner. I don't know how well you guys can see what the sun is. Uh, on the cab he did uh, white and uh, then with the blue stripes it's, yeah it's not too bad actually holding up pretty good nice and rough. it's like our repairs are holding for the most part And, uh, yeah, let's go see what Joe's up to and see if we can, uh, do some video on the inside see how it's holding up. Alright, Craig's rocked it. But, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty I amazing. I'm gonna, now that I'm working, I'm probably going to get this off the property. Yeah. The place up in Morongo, I think they'll keep them on a battery tender for, like, 50 bucks a month. Yeah, see, that's not bad. It's like, um... The Arnold with the boat. Yeah, he was storing it over here at the this at little this storage place, place. And it just and it's freaking like eighty something a month. I heard. Plus, I or somebody bought them out, and I heard they like doubled their rates or something. Some East Coast company ah. bought them out, and they're now called like I Rentals or some shit like that. <laughs> and I heard that they raised their rates by like forty percent. Yeah, and it, you know. So, um, yeah, because I remember Arnold was paying like 86 or What's he for? Is, is he still got it over? No, he's, uh, he got himself a house up uh, near Mission Legs. So he's living and, up there? Uh, yeah, so now he's got a nice big side yard. Well, who's living in that house? His mom. That's oh. his mom's house. Oh. And, uh, yeah, but he's got it up there now, and the landlords haven't uh, thrown him out yet. <laughs> well, I've, you know, I've had this five years. It's, it's time to get it off. I'm going to... In fact, when when he comes back from, oh hey, you wanted to see the inside? Yeah, yeah, I got the keys here. No, it's it's. In fact, I need to clean it up. I need to take a shower. You have the key? Yeah, you got the key. Yep, yep. It may be in the wrong. Can't remember if I was in it this morning. Yeah, have you played with that stereo much more yet? Yeah, man, it uh, it it rocks. That's what I need cool. is we need to find an amp and, and some speakers. speakers. I'll keep my eyes out. Dude, those speakers are hard. For this size, they fit in the holes up front. The 6 by 9s in the back will be easy. Mm -hmm. But it's it's to, to replace those, it's some odd size. You know? Yeah, we could almost... You know, we could just about, since you use this for storage mostly. Yeah, it's, you know, it's, it's, look, there's, you can see, I can't tell, like right there, if that's a water stain. Oh, that does look a little. And then off. over here, I think, I think, I think the window might be leaking. That wouldn't surprise me much. Those windows are just. No, I, you know, but it's a hell of a lot better than what it was, dude. Yeah. You know. Up there. Yeah, it's definitely, definitely was an experience. I think it's a better trim up there one of these days. That's yeah, no, a, yeah. Actually, tape was actually what I think I'm going to have you do this summer is something that you're going to dread. <laughs> you know what you're going to do? Oh, no. This. Ah. <laughs> we got to, we got to put with this, the carpet's got to come out. Yeah. And maybe a new toilet. Yeah, and I tell you, I, the rest of this thing won't be bad. I think after I conquered that, and I keep telling myself this, uh, I think anything would be possible. Dude, I drove, I mean, I, I, you know. Yeah, I, when we took it out, it was... I've, uh, I've been out and, you know, it's going to be fine. I've had it up and down to 10, 75, 80 miles an hour. Uh -huh. It's going to be fine. That window's, I'm not worried about it at all. 
And I've been thinking yeah. I could do this carpet. My carpet guy went to shit. So I think we could just cut it out. Cause, oh, yeah. I mean, because they put it down first and then built everything on top of it. Would you just cut back at a 45 degree angle along the bottoms of the walls? And that way you can tuck the new yeah, right now in. That I'm at, now i got a connection at Lowe's. Yeah, you could probably get you a know. deal on some uh, carpet, too. Yeah. Or just or figure out what we want to put on there. Mm hmm. Yeah, exactly. I wonder if Pergo would stick. Well, it's kind of like that up there, though. It's, I but think I'm, we you need know what? This actually came out fine. Look, I mean, this is... Yeah, it's not too bad, you know. Yeah, I mean, it looks like shit, but feel it. I mean, it's... It's, it's definitely solid. Yeah, so that's what I'm, when I get... When uh, Mark gets back, I'm going to cut this out, put that foam. I'm going to paint this whole area. Yep, yep. Because you know what? This is... That just... I'll just... I actually kind of like the way it looks like. And see, it's nice and smooth, so if you were to ever want to, you could even like, just throw a, another thin sheet of veneer over this. I just noticed that with this piece of trim. Yeah. If you just threw it like a... Uh, that is... Little, I thought the kills... You know, I need to put something... I need to put a little bit more foam and some... Is it window? Oh, yeah. Oh, fucking window ain't going anywhere. It's right there. Hardest... Uh, just I'll put a fucking little bit more foam or something right in there. Oh, that was fun getting that foam in there too. <laughs> oh, it was a motherfucker. Yeah. Overall, it's in good shape, man. Yeah, you know, it's still... Exactly, it'll always live in my mind. <laughs> yeah. You spent all summer doing it, man. In fact, gave you a... I about died. You about had a nervous breakdown. Yeah. <laughs> Headliner looks good, though. Heck, I think that's the probably the... looks good. No, it, yeah. it goes down the road good. Yeah, that was probably the second or third headliner I've ever done. Yeah, in no, it's... And, uh, Headliner looks really good. Yeah, I love that Naga hide. Yeah, that's no, it looks... I mean, the headliner looks really good. <laughs> Heck, yeah. But, man, this thing is still holding together. Yeah, no, it's going to be fine. And well, I've still got a... Um, I mean, we'll... You know. I've still got the roof mastic and uh, some of that caulking. So if we can find those leaks, yeah, so I can just, just figure out where they're at. Yeah, you know, we, I I need to get a. Uh, I'm, I'm going to buy one of Lowe's, a fucking air tank, and we'll put an air nozzle or something. You know what I mean? Yeah, and kind of pressurize and it. See if the we door. can figure out where it's. But it's not leaking. It's not. You know, we had. Remember, like in August, we had some really torrential rains in August. Mm -hmm. And it's really not that bad. And that's what makes me think it probably when it's um, when it's windy out, it probably blows it, under it from probably, somewhere. Probably, yeah. It's probably you know expanding and. Yep. Uh, oh, there it is. How are you guys doing? Uh, uh, good, good. Good. Uh, What's up, How guys? You Too much, man. Your wall hadn't fallen down yet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, things are holding up pretty good. It's, yeah, it's held up. Got a little oh, bit man. of. Have you had it out on the road yet? Yeah, built like a well, tank. Yeah, I think our leaks inside are coming from where the fiberglass uh, yeah. Yeah. creased on us. This is how badly the old uh, right. front end was sagging. Take care, man. Have a good day. Hey, uh, tell Nicholas I said hi. And uh, unfortunately, I wasn't right. able to. We weren't able to replace right. that panel. But uh, yeah, I think uh, Joe. Where this thing was creased before, yeah, remember, uh, it was like uh, creased up there. Oh no, it's so much better. Yeah, but I can see where there's like a divot. There. You think I think that's if we where, put you think the, that's where, yeah, I think it's probably yeah. it's probably coming from the outside, right in here, and dripping down. It's probably running down. Yeah, for when the wind's then, hitting it, and then just yeah. right. And of course, it's into the wind. Yeah, so it's so, blowing. So we need to put some just goo it up on that. I quarter. got plenty of that. Good stuff That's left. about all it needs. Then yeah. just put, I don't care what it looks like. Yeah. You know, no silicone. <laughs> you know, just we'll goo it up. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. But, uh, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna finish the rest of it off with like white. Just I'm gonna now, I, you know, I'm gonna yeah. I get from Lowe's, and I'm gonna re I'm gonna paint over this stuff with the same color, like just go get some Rust-Oleum Marine. Mm -hmm. And and see if I can make my stripes and finish the white off, because because uh, you can paint over this stuff, you know. Yeah, absolutely. And that's what I'm gonna do once it warms up. I hope my brother comes out with his airbrush uh, again. Oh man, that was my brother got a uh, airbrush a while back. He did. Uh, for, he makes those uh, miniatures, All right? Like, uh, tin soldiers, I guess. All right. But, oh really? But uh, they're like uh, the fantasy characters now. Yeah, like, the, yeah, yeah. The anime or whatever. They and he do. paints them, you know, he gets them in their uh, blank, and then he actually paints these little figures, I mean, eyeballs and everything else. Probably going to make, probably make, those things probably uh, bring all kinds of money. Yeah, oh God, that's a big uh, business you now. But, um, oh, my fucking coach battery. But yeah, he, he bought an airbrush to do the, uh, you know, the, the, detail. the basic, uh, well, to do the, the, um, the base coats, and the then deep, he, yeah. Do the detail by uh, by with the brush, See, but uh, now, where is the, the but we could fix this up. Man, that thing's fun. You brought it down. <laughs> we had a blast. That trim. It was a camping world. That's right. I need to drive into camping world. Yeah. We, oh, you finally found it to I where you can get it. I think it's camping world. God, that that one was such a pain in the butt. Well, either you had to you had to buy like. That was it. We had to buy like uh, 500 feet or yeah. something like that. It just, you know, it didn't make any sense. Exactly. But yeah, still holding together pretty good. No, it drives good, dude. Here, I'll, I mean, it goes down the road good. I think also, too, we'll tighten up these screws and the, the window screws again. Because over time they set. Yeah? You can see how it's kind of sagging a little bit in here now. You want to do that now before we load it up? Yeah, let me see here. Turn you guys back on a bit here. 